well met some nice people at the top chatting away everyone's always nice when <laughs> well everyone's always on their good side when they make their way up something like this um, we're going to start making our way down now and uh, hopefully not fall <laughs> it's very steep so we're going to put the GoPro away for now focus on getting down in one piece Yeah, well, yeah, we tried going, we went the wrong trail. Way. Yeah, did it go? Yeah, if you go up and round the back, it's like it's right there. Yeah, yeah, it's still very steep, so. Yeah, well, we, got, we, went, we turned the wrong direction and got stuck. In yeah, the well, we lost is... all the people. We're like, there are people <laughs> Yeah, the safest way is probably that way. Oh, hello. <laughs> I'm, uh, I'm the, I'm are you going up or down? Oh, oh sorry. <laughs> well, it's beautiful once you're up there. Well worth. No, no, you're like maybe. We uh, were seriously headed back the other way. Yeah. And we saw you guys. <laughs> maybe five minutes that way. Ah. Oh, the sun's back out again. to get hot again, are you serious? I'm gonna have to take all these jackets off at the, just at the bottom here. It's not for the faint of hearted, but definitely worth it. If you, oy oy oy. <laughs> if you've got flexible knees, Oh, it's lovely down here. Definitely feel like I caught the sun. So, it would be pretty nice to actually set the tent up here, but uh, I would be worried in case it picked up during the night. Tomorrow is meant to be another good day, but you know, you know, I'm not gonna risk it. Play it safe. Better to be safe than to be absolutely categorically sorry. We'll just enjoy the walk. You know, it's, uh, it's very re rewarding when you just take the whole day 
and I suppose night to just do something by yourself. It's nice to do with people as well, mind, but just when you've got that silence, you don't need to even you don't even need to think because what you're doing is living in that moment, which is uh, very rewarding. Yeah. Oh, these glasses as well, by the way, these are exquisite. They're not sunglasses, but they're blue light glasses. And they make what's already beautiful more beautiful. It's like HD vision. This one has horns. Oh no 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 no. Hello. You make that out? It's eyeing me up and I know the last time I got eyed up by a f goat that tried to ram me. Or whatever whatever it is. It's okay, they're friendly. Yay! It's beautiful, isn't it? Bah. Oh, there's two more down here. Oh, there's three. Oh, they're scared. Hello! I came up. Hello. I'm going. Don't worry. Wow. So going on here. Maybe that's too bright, but um, it's a beautiful little sunrise, eh, sunrise, sunset. It's a beautiful little stream and beautiful little goats. And out of the sun, which is pretty nice for my pale skin. Okay, there won't be much to see here, so I'll see you back at the car. Boop. So, we made it to Red Squirrel Campsite in Glencoe. Brought the car. Uh, we're going to set up somewhere. Actually, there's quite a nice place just down by the water there. I'm still trying to remember how it was. So I'm going to look around, find a place to set up for the night. Uh, try out my new spade axe and get some firewood maybe. Uh, but yeah, <laughs> it's cold and I'd like to get the tent up. Um, 
it's just beautiful around here. Now, obviously, we're in the valley now, so it's getting a little bit chilly. But, uh, uh, time to get that jet boil out, get some nice food going. Okay. Don't have much time left, so we're going to turn this into a time lapse. Get this tent set up before the sun actually does set. Okay. So, tents up. It was a lot harder than I thought it was going to be. Okay, it's getting really dark. Probably won't be able to see me. Fire did not work. The ground was too wet, and uh, the things I had were too wet. Which is a shame. I'm going to check the car to see if there's any paper. Uh, but if not, I'm just going to get cosy, and I'll see you inside the tent. We're on base camp. Uh, managed to get some sort of fire going, but I just need to lie down and eat. And, uh, yeah, it's been a long day. So we'll cook something and then I think we'll go to bed. Okay. Okay. Dinner tonight is spaghetti bolognese. So this is me for tonight. I'm going to say peace for now, I'm going to eat this and I'm going to try and get some sleep. So I don't even know how bright this is, wow. Um, we'll see you in the morning, hopefully for a sunrise. Bye. Good morning, from the car. I never made it in the tent last night, I got to 11.12. So it's getting really cold. I think it must have hit three, uh, two degrees last night. My sleeping bag was not efficient enough. So sleeping bags that are on sale are not worthy of cold temperatures. Good thing I tried that out. Invest in a better sleeping bag and better thermos. It was freezing last night. So I must have maybe I got five, six hours sleep, maybe five hours interrupted. But then I was just getting up and I was freezing cold, so I jumped in the car. Body feels rotten. <laughs> so I'm going to grab the tent, pack up, and then we're going to head into the valley of where we came from yesterday to where it's a bit more open. We missed the sunrise uh, as we are actually just surrounded in mountains here at the tip top of Glencoe. But it's still very beautiful. So... Let's get on it. got the tent packed up, uh, everything into the back of the car, not organised, I'm going to do that after I found breakfast, Whoa. and we're just driving back into the valley, back to the Green Wellington, and uh, back to civilization. I thought there were, I thought there were two people running on the road, and as I got closer it was, two, it was a goat, 
and uh, the little baby. So I stopped to say hi, but I didn't have time since I was on the road for the GoPro. So that's okay, till the next time. So, we made it back to the Green Welly. I'm gonna go in and see if the cafe's open. Maybe grab something to eat. And then, maybe we shall say our farewell. Well, the cafe was closed. Got a pie, a can of Coke. See if there's anything else open. So, uh, cafe was closed. I had to make my way to the, what is it? Well, it's the gas station connected to the cafe. And they done pies. So I got a pie. I got two lovely postcards. Now, uh, a lot of fun. Definitely got a lot to learn for the next times <laughs> and I'm definitely going to need to get a new sleeping bag because Yeah Definitely weather beaten. I look like I've aged five years since being up that hill So thanks very much for joining me. It's been a blast <laughs> And hopefully see you again soon in the next one For now See you later.